Are you a golf teacher? Are you a golf swing theorist? Are you a golf swing scientist? Are you just a golf scientist? Or are you an amateur um, follower of all theories golf? Do you have a uh, methodology group that you belong to? The golfing machine, Morad, stack and tilt, one plane, two plane. There's many others, obviously. Do you want to know for sure if what you are trying to do in your own golf swing or maybe trying to get your students to do, do you want to know if this is really scientifically correct or just somebody says it's scientifically correct? Then the symposium that I'm hosting on October the 11th, 2010 in Scottsdale, Arizona at the Hilton Garden Inn Perimeter Center North location, this is the event for you. We have three PhDs in the three most important parts of science to do with the golf swing. We have Dr. Rob Neal, a biomechanist, world famous. Golf Biodynamics is his company, also a consultant to Titleist TPI. We have Dr. Aaron Zick, an engineer by trade, but a physicist uh, as well, who really understands the math model of the golf swing that he's developed and is a brilliant guy and can help a lot of people understand the science behind how things work in the swing. Dr. Paul Wood, the uh, senior research engineer for Ping, one of the brightest guys in the business and absolutely uh, an expert on ball flight, club dynamics. So what you're dealing with right here is if you've got a theory like how much weight ought to be on the left foot at impact, which is the first topic we're going to have at this symposium, you're going to be able to ask not only these three experts from a biomechanical, from a physics, and from an engineering standpoint, is this is your theory that there's 80% of the weight on the left foot or 10% of the weight on the left foot or whatever your theory is, is this scientifically valid? But you're going to have a real-world panel as well. Friends of mine, some of the brightest guys in the golf business, Michael Finney, head professional at Lyle Creek in Louisville, Damon Lucas, the director of instruction at Lake Presidential, Upper Marlboro, Maryland, outside of D.C., Director of Instruction at Sir Wickley Heights, Kevin Shields, fine player in his own right. Director of Instruction of the Explosive Golf School, Michael Jacobs, that's on Long Island in New York. Steve Katib from Australia, GSEM with the golfing machine, really smart guy. Plus, you, the people in the audience at this symposium, are going to be on equal footing. We want your ideas, we want your theories. We want you to debate the experts. We want you to be right. So you can go home and say, hey, I'm right. I can brag about it for 99 years. Or, well, maybe find out that your ideas aren't exactly right. I'm sure that along the way, we'll find out some ideas that we believe, and I believe personally, might not be right either. I'm not a method teacher. I'll just go home and change what I teach tomorrow. But if you're a method teacher, maybe you can alter your method and help more people and help the game of golf continue to, uh, to grow and, and, and be the, the great game that we all love. Uh, it's only $250 for this symposium. Uh, we call it the Anti-Summit, and there's a reason we call it the Anti-Summit. Personally, Brian Manzella right here standing in front of you, I've been to every PGA Teaching and Coaching Summit all the way back to 1988. Hard to believe they're still having them. I mean, <laughs> it's just every two years a summit. Uh, all the AMF summits, another organization I belong to. All the golfing machine summits. Also, when um, MIT, great university, decided they were going to get in the uh, golf summit business for a couple of times, three times as a matter of fact, I talked to the, uh, one of them. Um, I've been to all of these, and they're all good, but they're basically all seminars. They're basically all someone talking from an expert point of view, and then you, the person at uh, the attendee, sitting in the audience, listening, and maybe, and I'm telling you now, maybe, getting to ask questions. This is not going to be anything like this, uh, like, like all of those previous, uh, because they, they are seminars. This is a symposium. We want to come up with what's, what I think is called some red letter items. We want to have a consensus, and the only way we're going to have a consensus is to have opposing views. We hope some people that, let's say, that follow my teaching don't believe in anything I have to say, to show up and, and, 
and rip my stuff one, one by one. And tell you what, I'm going to learn if I find out that I'm wrong about something. And I'm going to be able to improve my teaching. And maybe you'll find out that some of the stuff that I teach and you don't believe in is more right than you think. But uh, my position at this symposium is strictly to moderate. Matter of fact, a lot of times I will play the devil's advocate and take the other side if the other side isn't there. So we would like you to join us. If you want to register, you can do so today at brianmanzella.com forward slash anti-summit. It's $250. Like I said before, this is going to get you a continental breakfast, buffet lunch, and some snacks in the afternoon. It's going to be all day long. We're not even going to stop uh, uh, discussing even, even during lunch. And at the end of the day, we're all going to be the smarter for it. Look forward to seeing you there.